Modern-day research opportunities are broad and varied, with access to more resources and information than ever. We make new discoveries at a rapidly increasing rate. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we will be jumping into some discoveries that you may not have made note of, with some spanning the cosmos and others being right in someone's back garden. Untouched Mayan Ritual Cave Some of the most amazing discoveries are made while searching for something else, as was the case with an unbelievable cave that was discovered on Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula. Explorers with the Great Mayan Aquifier Project were hunting for a sacred well below a Mayan city in order to search for the water table that ran below the city. However, what they found instead was an ancient cave system called Balamku, or Jaguar God by the Mayans. The Mayans believed that caves and sinkholes were windows into the underworld and thus used this set of seven interconnected caves as ritual offering chambers. So when Guillermo de Anda uncovered the tunnel leading to the cave and managed to crawl on his stomach through the treacherous entryway, he was rewarded with piles and piles of incense burners, pots, and other ritual artifacts that have been sealed away from human eyes for centuries. Although the caves were discovered and briefly mentioned in a report in 1959, the entrances were immediately resealed and forgotten, and the contents inside have lain so undisturbed that stalagmites have grown around the artifacts scattered on the floor. The most important aspect of this find is what it can tell historians about the Mayan civilization at Chizen Isa, such as when it collapsed, as well as more intimate details of what exactly occurred in the ancient Mayan rituals that have been so mysterious and baffling for so long. De Anda, the explorer who was the first person inside the cave for many years, spoke about what this means for the archaeological community, saying, Balamku can tell us not only the moment of collapse of Chisen Isa, it can also probably tell us the moment of its beginning. Now we have a sealed context with a great quantity of information, including usable organic matter, that we can use to understand the development of Chisen Isa. It was truly fortunate that the cave was sealed following its discovery in the late 50s, as now archaeologists can use 3D mapping, paleontology and many new cutting-edge technologies to analyse the placement and composition of the artefacts, as well as preserve any that they may wish to remove from the caves. We can only wait and see what mysteries might be waiting to be solved. The Ross Ice Shelf is freezing, not melting. In 2017, a rather strange discovery was made in regard to the Ross Ice Shelf, the largest shelf of ice in Antarctica. This ice shelf, which has some points which reach an astonishing 10,000 feet thick, is one of many shelves which contain, restrain and generally hold back the ice of West Antarctica. It is estimated that if the Ross Ice Shelf does one day collapse, then the global sea level has the capability of rising by 10 feet. In November of 2017, a team of scientists from New Zealand investigated the Great Ross Ice Shelf using a hot water drill to create a tunnel-like gap for a thermometer and camera to go underneath the surface level. This technique gives us a snapshot of the environment below surface level, cluing scientists in as to the history of this ginormous shelf, as well as giving us more information as to what exactly it is doing now and the possible future happenings. With thoughts focused on global warming, this research team anticipated finding melting ice, though this is not the conclusion that the temperature and currents indicated. Contrary to expectations, the water beneath the Ross Ice Shelf seemed to be freezing and crystallizing, not melting. Christina Holb, a glaciologist from the University of Otago in New Zealand, was a co-leader on the project and summed up the strangeness of this discovery in four simple words when talking to National Geographic. It blew our minds. Plans to monitor the future of the Ross Ice Shelf have already been implemented, with the 2017 research team leaving instruments behind in order to measure currents and temperatures within the hole over the following years. The freezing of the ice shelf seems promising, suggesting it is plenty stable, at least for the time being. 
Scientists are also optimistic that the findings from this study will let us see if there have been any changes or melting that has happened in the past, as a direct result of climate shifts. Despite the overwhelmingly positive findings of this particular study, the climate crisis remains a prevalent and concerning threat to our planet, and one that is worsening at an accelerated and rapidly increasing pace. Global warming and the melting of ice caps is an issue we continue to face, with NASA confirming that we are losing ice in Antarctica at a quicker pace with each passing year. Whilst we are yet to determine exactly why we are seemingly so lucky with the peculiar freezing of the Ross Ice Shelf, it certainly is a positive sign that we are not facing the looming threat of the ice shelf collapsing anytime soon. Boy discovers tank from World War II at bottom of a lake. In Estonia, by Lake Kurtna Matashav, a local young boy stumbled across some peculiar tracks that appeared to lead towards the lake, but were never retraced. He decided more investigation was necessary. With Lake Kurtna Matashav being objectively too small for activities such as boating, coupled with its remote location, the tracks were certainly a point of curiosity. What could they possibly be from? Why were they leading to this lake? The local boy continued his observation over the next couple of months, noticing air bubbles spitting out from within the lake. He and a team began to delve deeper into the clues that they had at hand and pry more to see what else they could find out about these unexplained tracks. They definitely did not expect to retrieve a 1940s military tank from their small, local lake. The track, well ground into the dirt, coupled with the slow and continuous stream of bubbles, was certainly a cause for question. Though the sighting of these air bubbles led to the involvement of authorities to see what was behind this unusual occurrence. The process began at 9am to remove this colossal mystery item, with the weight clocking in at 30 tons, taking 8 long hours to move and the employment of giant steel cables and heavy-duty equipment, including a 68-ton bulldozer. When it became clear that the team was excavating a full-sized military tank, many locals were left with plenty of questions. The gigantic tank was clearly from the Second World War, marked and identifiable through the markings along it. Having inspected the markings a little closer, this tank appeared to be a Soviet-built tank a T-3476A, left in near-perfect condition before being taken over by German soldiers and eventually abandoned in the lake in order to prevent enemy forces from being able to access it. The tank has been fixed up, restored, and repaired. It has now been restored to its former glory. But what do you make of these three recent discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.